honestly, somehow it just ends up being there. I don't know how. It just all makes sense to me. And after all the studies and all my experiences, it just all comes together. And that is one of the main reasons I become so passionate about what we have here. Now, tonight I was supposed to be talking about canine health. I'm not sure how that all came to be. Um, so just for a minute, I do want to touch on that. But I want to get to something that's more important than that in regard to just our overall view of the products. Um, in terms of canine health, the thing that um, I want to express the most, first of all, my daughter's a veterinarian, not me, but my daughter is a veterinarian, and I hear firsthand from her all the different things that go on with canines. And canines are mammals, they're just like we are. And so one of the best things that you can take a look at is when you're looking at all the human studies, you need to know and understand that is exactly the same thing that happens in dogs. The difference is with dogs, especially, it's seven times faster. So that means it's that much more important for them to start early to take care of oxidative stress because oxidative stress is gonna affect them. Most people, when they think about their dogs aging, they think about their joints and they look at them and not be able to walk and to run and to do all the things they usually do. But the other things that take place are their cognitive thinking. And ultimately that's their happiness. They get depressed too. And so one of the biggest things that you'll see when people put their dogs on canine health is you'll right away start seeing a shift in the attitude of the dog. And when they did our initial studies with canine health, they couldn't even do it as a double blind test because the people that were actually really giving their dogs canine health could tell versus the people that were, you know, the other people weren't seeing any difference. And so it was kind of hard to have it be a double blinded study when the canine was hap happily running around and jumping around again, it was pretty obvious to them that they were actually getting the product. So the important thing to remember in terms of, of the pets is taking a look and making sure that they're getting the active um, ingredients um, through canine health. And if they're taking other things, like with ProTandem and us, you can have some interference. So make sure when you're checking with people in canine health that they're taking a look at if they're on uh, glucosamine and chondroitin or whatever, they really shouldn't need to, to take that along with canine health that may interfere. Um, so enough said about that. If you have extra special questions on canine health, you know what, I'll be more than happy to address those um, to some of you if you're Facebook friends with me or whatever, but we can get more into it then. But the bottom line is everything that applies to us with regard to oxidative stress affects them as well, but seven times faster and they respond faster. So having said that, one of the things that I wanted to talk to um, you about tonight was a conversation that Sharice and I had had um, a little um, while ago, a couple of days back. And it was in regard to people totally understanding um, the true uh, ability for us to utilize our ProTandem Nerf 1 and Nerf 2 through our body by making sure that we're having proper absorption. And so I just wanted to bring into account um, taking a look at the cleanse that we have and the probiotic, um, probio, because um, I think people are really underutilizing or un not understanding its true value and what it really means to have your gut and your brain connecting to each other in terms of really looking at optimum wellness. That's our path here. We're on a path to make sure that first, you know, we had Nerf 2 and we had ProTandem communicating with Nerf 2 pathway. That's where all of your genes are expressing and the good um, antioxidant production is happening. Then we have Nerf 1. That's the mitochondria repair. That's where you're going to start being able to have a much better mitochondria happening, which is the energy of the cell. That's going to drive the work that the ProTandem Nerf 2 is doing. You have to have the energy in that cell for it to be able to clean itself up, for it to be able to move and to do the things it needs to. In the chemistry of the brain, it takes energy to go from a, a nerve ending into the snaps of another nerve. All of those things are really important, and so that's how the Nerf 2 and the Nerf 1 work together. But what we really need to make sure that we're taking a look at is in our digestive tract. It is 30 feet long. Think about that. That's just insane to me. 30 feet from your mouth down to you know, and it's a really long tube. And that tube is what separates the outside environment from inside our body. Think about that. With all the stuff that we have outside, that's what's protecting us. And it's not 
a solid skin, it is porous. You know, the cells are put together in a fashion that they can move around a little bit. And so it's really important for that gut health to be maintained. And the best way we maintain that is by having proper probiotics in the lower digestive tract. So if you think about the lower digestive tract having a bunch of little garages, and all those little garages get full of trash. As they're full of trash, the good bacteria that needs to be down there breaking things up and helping us to um, utilize nutrients can't make their home in those garages. We need to have them make that home. So it's really important to start on the cleanse. When you have the cleanse, it's going to go in gently. At first, I was a little concerned when I saw a cleanse because sometimes that makes me nervous. But this is a very gentle cleanse. It's for a week. And what it does is it takes the trash out of those little garages, and that makes room when you start taking the probio. Then the probio can move those good bacterial strains into those garages, start making a home. And the, the whole idea is that you get more and more of those garages full of these good bacteria, and then once a month, and maybe after once a month for a few months, you can back off a little, but that beginning of the month, every time you're gonna take the trash out that's building up again in some of those garages, get it out, and then the probiotic is able to be able to stay home in those garages, and it also helps to feed those little biomes, those little homes in those garages. And when that probiotic um, it gets down there, one of the things that makes ours so special is it also has Wellmune in it. And that Wellmune literally goes in, and as it's absorbed, it attaches to our white cells. If you can imagine, it goes through that stomach lining, and it attaches, and it helps the white cells to go find the toxins and to find the bad things. And so it really enhances our ability to take care of our immune system. All of that upregulates into the brain and communicates back and forth with the brain, telling the brain, okay, absorb more foods. That allows protandum to be taken in on a NERF 2 level, again, even greater. And then the mitochondria, as they're repairing, help with the energy. So it all works together. And um, I just think that that's a really important um, process for people because I think a lot of people may say to people, well, I'm on a probiotic. Our probiotic is unique. With the BioTrack system in it, you're going to absorb up to 60% of those um, uh, groups of uh, probiotic, and we need to be able to absorb those. Most products out there, you get maybe 10 to 20% of them. They may have tons and tons of them listed, but you're not taking them in and you're not able to utilize them. So it's really important that you understand the BioTrack is going to bring that in there, then the Wellmune is going to um, really help with your immune system. So I, I don't know if that all made sense, but hopefully um, it gives you a better idea of why it's important when they tell you other probiotics, they don't contain Wellmune. This is a patented product, again, you know, where we have this Wellmune inside this, and there's not other probiotics with that. Wow. Okay. Thank you, Nancy, so much. That makes sense. I'm a visual person, and to think about cleaning out the garage and so they give it room for the good stuff, I'm all about that. And also, we were talking about how that Nerf won. Once that the garages are cleaned out and the ProBio can work and everything can get absorbed, that Nerf won, really the number one, I guess, symptom, if you will, what we were talking about of of any mitochondrial disease or mitochondrial dysfunction is fatigue, correct? Yes, yes. And, it, and it's, it's an old, overall body fatigue, but it's a mental fatigue as well. And so, again, all the cells of our body have different functions, but if they don't have the energy to drive that cell, it can make it really difficult. And so one of the biggest things um, that we see when we first start taking Nerf One, sometimes people do experience a little bit of tiredness because they've had a lot of mitochondrial repair. In that case, and I've had many people comment to me after they've heard me on Zoom in the past, that when I mentioned to them, maybe take it at nighttime if you're finding yourself a little bit tired at first, that is a good time to take it because your body is repairing and that's a good time for repair. 
But what you may find is later on down the road, after you get through that first six weeks, that you can resume taking it in the daytime. And you're going to find yourself having so much more energy just overall. It's almost like your body is lighter.